I'll never get this thing up. We'll help you put it up. Oh, thank you, Bananas. Helpful as always. How's that, Rat? Hmm, let's see. A little to the left. Whoa! Now a fraction to the right. Whoa! A bit this way. Now that. There. Perfect. Just a little slip, Rat. We'll get this back up in no time. No, or, or I'll have no more shop left. What's the sign for anyway, Rat? The Jam Jamboree. Jam Jamboree? A competition to find the tastiest jam in Cuddlestown, which I'm sure I'll win with my special cheese and cherry jam. Mmm, sounds delicious. jam -a -rama. Bye, Rat. Rat. Bye, Bananas. Hello, Camembert. Did you hear about the jam jamboree? Hasn't everybody? I'm making blackberry jam. And I'm making strawberry jam. And I'm making mud and pickle jam. Mud, mud and pickle? pickle? Ooh. Oh, just wait till you try it. But who's going to decide which jam is the best? You can't have a jam jamboree without a judge. But who? It has to be someone who loves food. What a delicious apple. It's crisp, it's crunchy, it's perfect. Morgan! Morgan. Huh? What did I do? Uh, congratulations, my boy. You are hereby appointed judge of the Jam Jamboree. That couch looks so uncomfortable. Would you like a cushion to sit on? Thanks, Amy. And a nice cool drink of water. Don't mind if I do. And a plate of munchy honey cakes. Mmm, yum. So, uh, Morgan, do you think you could vote for our blueberry jam? So we can win the jam jamboree? Sorry, but I can't play favourites, not even for my friends. I'll judge every jam on the day and the tastiest one will win. Huh. Then you won't need these honey cakes. Or the water. Or this cushion. Oh, OK. I'll go and play with my boat then. Well, if it isn't my best friend, Morgan. Hi, Charlie. Like to taste my pineapple jam? I could fix your broken swing while I'm here. Thanks, Charlie, but I'll judge every jam on the day and the tastiest one will win. Morgan. Sorry, Bananas, but there's nothing you can do to make me vote for your jam at the Jam Jamboree. We don't want you to vote for our jam. We just want to tell you a storm is coming. Thanks, Bananas, but a little rain doesn't worry me. I'm going to stay here and play. Rain or no rain. The rain is so heavy, Lulu. And poor Morgan's still outside. Morgan! You're soaked to the skin. <laughs> Only one more day till the Jam Jamboree, B1. I can hardly wait, B2. And Morgan is the luckiest bear in Cuddlestown. He gets to taste them all. Hello, Amy. How's that lucky bear, Morgan? You'd better come inside and see. Hello, Morgan. Hello, bananas. You sound like you've got a cold. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I had a terrible cold. And now his nose is all blocked and he can't smell a thing. But what about the jam jamboree? Will you still be all right to judge it? <laughs> Don't worry, bananas. I'll be fine. Past the teeth and past the gums. Look out, tummy. Here, Here it comes. comes. Yuck! 
What is it? Mm. Sorry, Morgan. But this soup tastes... Mm. <coughs> tastes okay to me. But what about the smell? I can't smell a thing. Oh, no! Morgan's blocked nose means he can't taste things properly. I can taste things probably. Then let's do a test to make sure. Wear this blindfold so you can't see what you're eating. Huh? Here, Morgan. Can you tell me what this is? <coughs> is that an apple? An apple? Correct. Now, try this, Morgan. Lulu, that's an onion. I know. <laughs> let's see what he tastes. Is it an apple too? No, it's an onion. An onion? What do you know? It tasted like an apple. Morgan's nose is too blocked. If he can't tell the difference between an apple and an onion, how's he going to taste the jam at the Jam Jamboree? Are you thinking what I'm thinking, B1? I think I am, B2. It's, it's clear, clear Morgan's nose time. time. Are you sure this is a good idea, Bananas? Lots of fresh air is good for colds. Ready, Morgan? Ready, Bananas. OK, Charlie, turn it on. <laughs> Taste this, Morgan. Do you know what it is? Is it an apple? No, it's an onion. Morgan still can't taste anything. Well, there must be something else we can try. There is. It's the only thing left. Stinky soup. I wonder why they call it stinky soup. Oh! Hey, you! I don't smell a thing. You're so lucky. Because we do. <laughs> Hello, Teddies. Oh, bananas. What a terrible smell. It's that stinky soup, of course. Lots of smelling garlic and Morgan's football socks. <laughs> Let's hope the smell clears Morgan's nose for good. Sniff away, Morgan. I smell nothing. I think my nose is still blocked. Oh, it's no good. There's no way he can judge the jam jamboree. Someone else will have to judge the jam instead. Are you thinking what I'm thinking, B1? I think I am, B2. It's jam judging time! This is so exciting! I wonder whose jam will win? We'll soon find out. Here come the judges now. All set to taste some jam, Judge 1? Tasting spoon ready, Judge 2. Oh, I wish I could judge the jam jamboree, but my nose is still bogged. Hmm, which jam will we taste first, Judge One? They all look so good, Judge Two. Well, try my cheese and cherry jam first, Bananas. It's the tastiest by far. Sorry, Rat, but ours is best. Try our blueberry. I'm sure they'd rather try my strawberry. No, my mud and pickle is brilliant. But not nearly as nice as my blackberry jam. Which isn't a patch on my pineapple. Here, Bananas, take a spoonful. <laughs> no, ours first. No, mine. Wait. Don't worry. We'll try them all. Pineapple B2? Hmm. No, that's the cheese and cherry B1. Hang on. I thought this was cheese and cherry. Mm. No, that was the mud and pickle. I think I've spilt the strawberry. Ah, oh, now it's mixed up with the blackberry. Oh, I think I'm getting mixed up too, B2. We're both mixed up, B1. No, no, no. My jam jamboree is turning into a disaster. Stop! Oh dear! I'll get it! I can smell. That sneeze must have cleared my nose. And I can smell these grapes. Morgan's nose is all better. Now he can judge the jam jamboree. 
But all the jams are mixed up together. How can he tell which one's the best? Okay, Nose, do your job. Hmm. Well, what do you think? I think if you mix a little bit of this jam with a little bit of that and little bits from all the rest... Here, try it. Delicious jam I've ever tasted. Do you see that, B1? Morgan's made the Cuddlestown Fruit Salad Jam B2. Now everyone's a winner. Yay! Yay! <laughs> now my nose is back to normal, I thought I'd cook some soup to celebrate. Mmm, <gasps> delicious, Morgan. I think it's your best soup ever. <laughs> But there's something a little different. Something extra tasty. I wonder what it could be. I think I know. My football sock. Oh, Morgan! I'm sorry, I didn't mean for that to happen. I wonder what happened to the other one. It's right here. Socks are like bananas, aren't they, B1? Why is that, B2? You should always have two together. Oh, bananas! <laughs> it's a beautiful day, B1. It certainly is, B2. What should we do with it? Hmm. I know, B1. Let's go and visit Rat. Good idea, B2. How am I ever going to carry all this? Rat? Are you here? Oh, uh, coming, Bananas! Hmm. Maybe I won't need to carry all this after all. Hello, Rat! Oh, uh, hello, Bananas. Lucky you caught me. I was about to hike up to the waterfall for the day. Why are you going up there, Rat? I'll show you, Bananas. This is my collection of pressed flowers, which I've collected from all over the countryside. Ooh, they're pretty. But why are those pages blank, Rat? Those pages are waiting for a very special flower. A flower I've been searching for for many years. The purple polka-dotted peony flower. Ooh. But it only grows beside waterfalls, and it only blooms for one day of the year. Today! Is that why you're going to the waterfall, Rat? To find it? Exactly! And what a marvellous day it will be, Bananas! Just imagine, breathing the fresh mountain air on a perfect day. Oh, bliss! Don't you think so, Bananas? Hmm... Bliss! bliss. Oh! Anyway, I can't hang around chatting. Not if I want to get to the waterfall today. Uh, bye, Bananas. I'm off. Oh, uh, wait a minute, Rat. I, I don't suppose we could come with you? Uh, bananas, I always go on my flower collecting trips alone. But we wouldn't be any trouble, Rat. We promise. Well, all right. Thank you, Rat! But only if you can get ready right away. Let's get our hiking gear, B1. As fast as we can, B2. <laughs> Here we are, Rat. Oh, that's good, Bananas. Now, this is all our equipment. We have to take all that? worry, Bananas. Once it's divided between the three of us, it won't seem like so much. That's true, B1. Very true, B2. Uh, so, you can take that, B1. And you take that, B2. And I'll take this. All right, then. Off we go. Oh, uh, Rat, rat wait. wait! Can't stop, Bananas. Not if we want to get to the waterfall by lunchtime. Oh, oh dear. dear. Oh! <laughs> what a magnificent day! Isn't this 
fun, bananas? Oh, uh, what was that, Red? I said, isn't this fun? Oh, yes, Red. Heaps of... Oh, but... Oh. Oops! Oh. Do try and keep up, bananas. Coming, Red. Red. Oh, isn't this beautiful? The perfect spot to find the purple polka-dotted peony flower. Oh, oh, we made it, B1. Uh, at last, B2. Now we can have a rest. Uh, bananas, I hate to tell you this. What, Rat? I'm not sure this is the perfect spot to find the purple polka-dotted peony after all. Isn't it? We're beside the waterfall, Rat. I isn't that where it grows? Apparently, the flower only grows in the spray from the waterfall, which is over the other side. Look! This is where we cross bananas. Uh, are you sure, Rat? Those stepping stones are a long way apart. <laughs> it's easy, bananas. Watch! See? Now you try. Ready, B1? Uh, if you are B2. Here, Here goes! I'll save you, B1! Bananas, now all our things are wet. Sorry, rat. Ah, there. The tent's up. Bananas. We can't possibly go flower hunting on an empty stomach. We need to make lunch first. Here's everything you need. I'll have a cheese and salad sandwich with tomato relish, thanks. Uh, aren't you going to help, Rat? Oh, I wish I could, Bananas, but I... I cut my finger on a sharp leaf. Oh, sorry. <sighs> <laughs> Gentlemen, it's time to go flower hunting. At last, B1. Now, we just need to take this, 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 and this. Uh, what about you, Rat? Aren't you carrying anything? Me? Oh, sorry, Bananas, but I need my hands free to collect flowers, right? Right. right. Let's go! The purple polka-dotted peony awaits. Is this trip as much fun as you thought it would be, B1? Not quite, B2. But Rat seems to be enjoying himself. Come on, Bananas. Less talking, more walking. Uh, <laughs> oh, nothing. Nothing at all. No purple polka-dotted peonies anywhere. Well, that's disappointing, B1. In fact, I'm starting to think this might not be the perfect spot after all. What about that bush over there, Rat? It has purple flowers on it. Bananas, please. Leave the flower spotting to the experts, like me. All this searching has worn me out. Would you mind setting up my chair, Bananas? Oh, sure, Rat. Chair, B1. Bananas? Here it is, B2. Oh, at last. There. <sighs> Rat's asleep already, B1. Sound asleep, B2. Now what should we do? Are you thinking what I'm thinking, B1? I think I am, B2. It's flower hunting time! <gasps> what? Shh! <sighs> All set, B1? All set, B2. Let's, Let's go! go. <laughs> Let's look over here, B1. That's the bush I saw before, B2. Do you think... Could they really be? Let's check Rat's book. 
Here's the picture. I can't believe it. It's, it's the, the purple polka dotted peony. <laughs> Should we pick one, B1? I'm not sure, B2. They look so lovely growing on the bush. They do, B1. I think we should just leave them here to keep growing. But what would we tell Rat, B2? Hmm. Good question, B1. Uh, why don't we tell him the flowers were covered in wasps? Nah, he'd never believe that, B2. But, B1, <laughs> look! Oh, no! Wasps! Huh? Bananas? What are they doing? Cheese and whiskers. They found the purple polka dotted peony flowers without me. Bananas? Those flowers are mine. No, Rat. You have to stay away. Don't go near them. What? Oh, don't be silly. But, Rat, there's a big swarm out of my way, Bananas. I'm adding this flower to my collection and nothing's going to stop me. Cheese and whiskers! Ah! At least Rat got rid of the wasps, B1. He certainly did, B2. Look, B1, there's a flower on the ground. So there is, B2. It wouldn't hurt to take one that's already fallen off, would it? I can't see how, B2. Oh! Ah! I suppose we should rescue Rat, B1. We probably should, B2. Hurry, Bananas! Hurry! Rat's flower collection is very beautiful, Bananas. But you haven't seen the best flower of all, Teddies. Oh, my! However did you find such a magnificent flower, Rat? Well, Teddies, the truth is I could never have done it without the Bananas' help. Which is why I've cooked a bunch of munchy honey cakes to say thank you, Bananas. Thank you, Rat. But do you know, there is one more flower I'd love to add to my collection. There is? The pink and white striped petunia. Isn't it marvellous? Um, perhaps you could help me find that one too, Bananas. Ah, uh, thanks, Rat. But I think one flower hunting trip is plenty. Don't you be one? More than plenty, B2. <laughs> Arr! I'm Pirate Morgan! We've got a treasure to bury. Ooh, treasure. treasure! Let's start digging, Pirate B1. Aye, aye, Pirate B2. Oof! Uh, playing pirates, Bananas. <laughs> That's right, Rat. We're burying this treasure. Oh, you know, my great-grandfather was a real pirate. A real pirate? I didn't know there were real pirates. His name was Peg Leg Rat. He buried his treasure under Cuddles Avenue. And no one has ever found it. There's real treasure buried under Cuddles Avenue. Absolutely. It's been there for years. Oh, Rat, that's just a story. Well... Uh, maybe it is a story. Or maybe there's buried treasure just waiting for someone to find it. Oh, a real buried treasure, B1? Which no one has ever found, B2. Are you thinking what I'm thinking, B1? I think I am, B2. It's treasure hunting time. What a good idea, Bananas. Uh, Rat, there's just one problem. How will we know where to look for this treasure? What an excellent question, Bananas. And it just so happens that I have the answer. I know it's in here somewhere. Ah, here it is. <coughs> <coughs> now, this is what you need to find the treasure, Bananas. It's a metal detector. 
Oh! Uh, what's a metal detector rat? I'll show you! I put this metal coin under the rug, like so. Then I run the metal detector over it and... Ta-da! 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 It can find metal through anything, even under the ground. And since treasure is metal... It'll show us where the treasure is. That's right! We'll buy it, Rat! A very wise decision, Bernard. With this metal detector, we'll find the treasure in no time, B1. And we can dig it up with these shovels, Rat sold us, B2. So, so let's start treasure hunting! Treasure already, B1. Let's start digging, B2. Oh! Oops. Sorry, B2. No harm done, B1. Oh! Sorry, B1. <laughs> Not to worry, B2. Look, B2. There's something sparkly down there. It looks like diamonds. We found, found the, the treasure. treasure. This is so exciting, B1. I can't believe we've actually found a, a hairband. Well, that's not treasure, B2. But it's a nice hairband, B1. Very nice, B2. I think we've seen it somewhere before. You're right, B1. We've seen someone wearing it. But who? Topsy! Oh, hello, Bananas. Hello, Topsy. We found something we think belongs to you. Ta-da! Oh, you found my hairband! My favourite hairband! I lost this ages ago in the park. How did you ever find it, Bananas? Well, we were digging for treasure and we found your hairband instead. Well, this is treasure to me. Thank you so much, Bananas. <coughs> mwah, mwah. Oh, uh... We better get back to our treasure hunt, B1. Yes, right away, B2. <laughs> Bye, bananas. Thanks again. I don't know why we didn't try the beach first, B1. Yes, there's sure to be treasure here, B2. Ooh. Let's start digging, B2. Wait a minute, B1. We don't want to cover each other with dirt like last time. Definitely not, B2. So why don't I dig and you stand over there? Good idea, B2. Ahem. Uh, B2, maybe you could throw the sand the other way? Oops, sorry, B1. Look, B2, there's something shiny in the hole. It looks like silver, B1. We, we found, found the, the treasure. treasure. This is it, B2. A real buried... Bicycle bell? That's not treasure, B1. No, B2. But I think I know who it belongs to. Morgan! Hello, Morgan. Oh, hello, Bananas. Did you lose this by any chance? My bicycle bell. Where did you find it, Bananas? Well, we were digging for treasure. And we found your bell instead. Thanks, Bananas. I got this for my birthday, so I was really sad when I lost it. I'm going to put it on my bike right now. And we'd better get back to our treasure hunt, B1. Definitely, B2. Bye, Morgan. Bye, Bananas. And thank you. What are you doing, Bananas? We're looking for treasure, Pedro. Pirate treasure. Pirate treasure? Will I never, never, ever? Ooh! It must be the treasure this time, B1. It has to be, B2. Let's dig it up. <laughs> oh, 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 bananas. Oops. Oops. Sorry, Pedro. Uh, that's all right, bananas. I quite like mud. Look, B2. There's something shiny down there. It looks like gold, B1. We've, We've really, really found, found the, the treasure, treasure this time. time. Oh, how exciting. How very exciting. Oh, no. This isn't treasure either, B2. Oh, 
How unexciting. How very unexciting. I think I've seen that watch before, Bananas. So have we, Pedro. Hello, Hello Bernard. Bernard. Look what we found. Oh, my old gold watch. I thought it was lost forever. Oh, I'm so glad you found it, Bananas. My grandfather gave it to me. It's very special. Hello, Morgan. Look, the bananas found my bicycle belt, too. And my favourite hairband. Well, well. Sounds like you found all kinds of treasures, bananas. We have. All except the treasure we were looking for. We can't find that anywhere. Can we, B1? No, B2. Still, I suppose we'd better keep looking. Bye, everyone. Bye, Bye bananas. bananas. Oh, poor bananas. What a pity they can't find the treasure. Especially when they've been so nice returning all our things. If only there was something we could do to cheer them up. Maybe there is. Listen. <laughs> Quick, Topsy, hide. <laughs> Hello? There's no one here, B2. That's odd, B1. Wait a minute. What's this? Looks like a map, B2. There's a big X. And a skull and crossbones. It's, it's a, a pirate, pirate treasure, treasure map. <laughs> Look, the treasure is at the beach, B1. Let's get down there right away, B2. Bananas are right behind us. Who oh, are uh, coming? The map shows the treasure near that palm tree, B1. Let's see if the metal detector can find it, B2. We found it, B1. Dig as fast as you can, B2. <laughs> Look, B1. A, A real, real treasure chest. chest. This must be Peg Leg Rat's treasure, B2. Let's open it, B1. <gasps> gold! Wait a minute, B1. This isn't gold. It's chocolate. Chocolate? That's even better, B2. But, B1, why would Peg Leg Rat bury chocolate? <coughs> I'm afraid. It isn't real pirate treasure, Bananas. Bernard? Morgan? Topsy? What are you doing here? We buried that treasure, Bananas. And we made the map so you could find it. We wanted to say thank you for returning all our treasures, Bananas. So we buried a treasure for you to find. You did? For us? Uh-huh. B1, I think making our friends happy is even better than finding the real treasure. You're right, B2. And I think chocolate treasure is better than gold anyway. Uh, did someone say gold? What? You found the treasure? That's... that's amazing. I didn't even think there was one. This isn't Peg Leg's treasure, Rat. It's a different treasure altogether. But if you found one treasure, that means there could be more. Rat, you don't understand. <laughs> oh, yes, I do. I want to buy that metal detector back so I can start looking. But you'll be wasting your time, Rat. We'll see about that. Peg Leg's treasure is as good as mine. Mine! Mine, I tell you! Oh, oh that, that rat, rat in a hat. hat. Here, have some treasure, everyone. It's the yummiest treasure ever. <laughs> <laughs> What a pyjama rama day, B2. banana rific B1. And what better place to spend it than at a wonderful... Beautiful... Oh. Rubbish heap. Where's our beach? It must be there somewhere. Somewhere under all that rubbish. 
Are you thinking what I'm thinking, B1? I think I am, B2. It's clean-up time! <laughs> B1? Not for long, B2. Got it! Did you see that twinkle? I did see that twinkle. She's, She's beautiful! beautiful. How did she get there? A big wave must have brought her in. And now she's trapped. We should put her back in the sea. We will. Uh, how do we do this, B2? Um, I don't know, B1. We can't pick her up in our hands. And she has to stay in water. We need something to pick up her and some water. Something that won't leak. Something like a plastic bag. Something like that plastic bag. It's perfect, B2. Gently does it, B1? Gently it is, B2. Oh, she's even more beautiful up close. And twinkly. She's very tiny too. Maybe too tiny to look after herself in the great big ocean. Maybe we shouldn't put her back in the sea, then. And we can't just leave her in the rock pool. Oh, dear. What should we do? Are you thinking what I'm thinking, B2? I think I am, B1. We'll, we'll take, take her home, home with us. We'll give you lots of food, little fish. Healthy food to make you big and strong. Then we'll put you back in the sea. And you'll be happy for the rest of your days. Hey there, little fish. Guess what, little fish? You're coming home with us to stay. We'll have lots of fun under the golden sun. And you can swim and laugh all day. B2, do you think our little fish likes being called little fish? We should give her a name. Something like... Uh, what about... Um... Are you thinking what I'm thinking, B2? I think I am, B1. We'll call her Twinkle. Well, she doesn't look very happy, B2. This bag is too small, B1. And not very safe either. We'd better hurry home then. Watch out for the log, B1. Couldn't be easier, B2. What is it? Look! Twinkle! Uh, uh, Catch her! Grab her! Hold her! Uh, uh, where's Twinkle? We've lost her! No, we haven't! Oh. That was close, Twinkle! Sorry, Twinkle! We need something else for Twinkle to live in. We need an aquarium. Yes, an aquarium. But, 
B1? Yes, B2? Where can we find an aquarium? Uh, not the teddies. Not Rat. Not Bernard. Charlie! Twinkle? And now that's a name just right for this little one. She needs an aquarium, Charlie. An aquarium? Hmm. <laughs> yes, indeed. I'm sure I have an aquarium hmm, somewhere here. Charlie, would that be the aquarium? That? Oh, no, 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 no. Are you sure, Charlie? Extraordinary! That is it! Could we have it for Twinkle? It's all yours, Bananas. Anything for Twinkle. This needs a clean. So we need some soap and water. We'll be right back, Twinkle. Twinkle, the sooner you're safely in your aquarium, the better. But we still have to clean it. Now, where are those buckets? Buckets. Buckets. Buckets! <laughs> now that's what I call clean, B2. Sparkly clean, B1. A sparkly new home for our new friend, Twinkle. All done. All it needs now is Twinkle. Twinkle! She's bouncing again. We'll save you. No! Where did Twinkle go now? Look! She's swinging. And flying. The window. She should be very happy in there. It's a wonderful new home. I don't think she likes it, B2. I don't think so either, B1. Now what do we do? Hmm, I see what you mean, Bananas. Twinkle is definitely most unhappy. Oh dear. That must mean... Twinkle, Twinkle doesn't, doesn't like, like us! us. Oh! Uh, let's not be hasty, Bananas. I've been deducing the evidence. Ooh, deducing? That sounds good. What's deducing, Charlie? It's working out what might be the answer. I'm quite sure she likes you both. She does? But she likes this even more. What is that, Charlie? It's the sea. The sea? Her home. She's homesick. Precisely. But we do plan to take her back home, Charlie. But only when she's bigger and stronger. Twinkle thanks you for that, but she'd much rather look after herself. Twinkle, is that what you really want? I think that's a yes, B2. I think so too, B1. We're sorry for taking you away from your home, Twinkle. Do you forgive us? 
Oh, thank you, Twinkle. Time to go, then. Gently now, B2. Gently always, B1. Goodbye, Twinkle. Keep safe. Now Twinkle's back where she belongs. But I'm still sad to see her go. Oh, so am I. <sighs> but I'm happy that she's home. So am I. And speaking of home... It's time we went home too, B2. You're so right, B1.